Hi guys, it's me, Teacher Gon. In our today's video, we will do finding the equation of a line given a point and a slope. So last time, we have uploaded a video on how to find the equation of a line given the coordinates of two points of n linear equation. So right now, ang pinaka-method naman natin dito is yung paggamit ng tinatawag nating point-slope form which is yung y minus y sub 1 is equal to m times x minus x sub 1. This formula is applicable if the given information is a slope and a point from a line. Okay? So, again, we have here y minus y sub 1 is equal to m times x minus x sub 1. So, without further ado, let's do this topic. So, sabi sa problem natin, find the equation of a line given the following slope and point. So, letter A, we need to express our answer in y is equal to mx plus b. And letter B, we need to also express our equation in standard form. And these are the given information. So, we have two examples. Let's start with number 1. m is equal to 4. Your slope is 4. And then the given point has the coordinates of negative 2 and 5. So given this formula, yung ating point slope form, y minus y sub 1, is equal to m times x minus x sub 1. Don't worry kasi madali lang naman ito. So lagyan mo na natin label. Sa coordinates natin, tandaan nyo, lagyan nyo ng x sub 1, y sub 1. And after that, isubstitute nyo na yung value ng slope at ng inyong mga coordinates. So you have y minus ang y sub 1 minus 5 is equal to your m which is equal to 4. So 4 times x minus ang yung x sub 1 is negative 2. So minus yan, since negative yan. So gawin natin in close by parenthesis yung negative 2. So you have y minus 5 is equal to 4. Simplify natin itong part na to, Times x plus 2. Bakit naging x plus 2? Because negative times negative, that is positive. And then by distributive property, you have y minus 5. Then 4 times x, that will give you 4x. 4 times 2, that is plus 8. Now, sabi sa ating problem, we need to express our answer in slope-intercept form. So, para maging y is equal to mx plus b, transpose na natin sa negative 5 sa yung kabilang side ng equation. So, you have now y is equal to 4x plus 8 plus 5. Simplifying this equation, we can have y is equal to 4x plus 13. This is the slope intercept this is the slope intercept form of that equation. So next naman ang target natin is going siyang ax plus by is equal to c. So ang gagawin lang naman natin dito so transpose natin si 4x sa kabila dito given that you have negative 4x plus y is equal to 13. Tapos, di ba sabi ko sa inyo? We need to secure that our equation is in... Okay, our equation in standard form, yung first term niya dapat ay positive. So, multiply the whole equation by negative 1. Lahat ng sign na yung magbabago. So, you have 4x minus y is equal to negative 13. This is the standard form of the equation, given the slope of 4 and the coordinates of 2, negative 5. Let's move on with the next example. So we have your m as negative, sorry, your slope is 1 half, and the coordinates of the point is 1 and 5. So this is your x sub 1, y sub 1. So you have y minus y sub 1 is equal to m, 
times x minus x sub 1. Palitan lahat na kailangan palitan. You have your y. Yung y sub 1 is 5. So, minus 5. Yung m mo, o yung slope is 1 half. It's equal to 1 over 2 times your x. Yung x sub 1 mo is 1. Minus 1. And then, meron tayong denominator. Multiply the whole equation by 2. So, you have 2y minus 10. Say 2 times y is 2y. 2 times negative 5 is negative 10 is equal to... Ito naman, ang purpose kasi ito matanggal ito. So, meron ka na lang ngayon 1 times x minus 1. Pero, useless na itong 1 na ito. So, we need to erase this. Ang target natin ngayon is gawin siyang slope intercept. Transpose natin sa kabila ito. So, you have 2y gawin natin na slope intercept eh. Transpose mo natin ito dito. So, you have 2y is equal to x minus 1 plus 10. So, you have 2y is equal to x plus 9 divided by 2. y is equal to x plus 9 over 2. Or, y is equal to x over 2 plus 9 over 2. Yun ang ating slope intercept form. No y is equal to mx plus b. Ngayon naman, paano naman yung ating standard form? ax plus by is equal to c. Copy natin tong isang to. Ito, ito yung copy natin. You have y is equal to x plus 9 over 2. Multiply the whole equation by 2. Isa natin sulat natin. You have y is equal to x plus 9 over 2. Multiply the whole equation by 2. So you have 2y is equal to cancel to x plus 9. So ang gagawin lang natin, transpose natin si 2y dito. Or sige na nga, si x na lang transpose natin. It will become negative x plus 2y is equal to 9. Para maging positive yung first term. Negative 1, negative 1. Multiply yung magbago lahat ng sign. x minus 2y is equal to negative 9. This is the standard form. Okay? So, I hope na sa dalawang examples natin ngayon, ay natutunan nyo kung paano maghanap ng equation of a line given the slope and a point. So, kung bago ka lang sa YouTube channel ko, don't forget to like and subscribe para update ka sa ating mga future uploads. Again, I'm Teacher Gon. Maraming maraming salamat. Bye-bye! Hi guys! You can also like and follow our Facebook page which is named as Math Teacher Gon. We're uploading this for our followers on Facebook. So, I hope na ma-follow nyo rin at makita o kaya ma-visit ang ating page. So, right now, uh, we have we have 14,000 followers and likers of this page and I hope na makasama namin kayo sa page na to. God bless.